Hey guys, welcome to my brand new gameplay. Another Minecraft, mo well not a mod. Not, well, it's slightly modded but it isn't. <laughs> I'll get to that in a second. It's uh, a map download gameplay for Pillar Survival. Now, someone in the comments has asked that I do something like uh, Sky Drop Survival. Um, this is quite similar, just has differences of course. And uh, yeah, I thought I'd do this. Now, the reason I'm doing this now instead sort of waiting till you know, some of my other stuff's finished is because I'm having some issues with my Millionaire mod playthrough. I can't get into the game properly because of Forge. I'm trying to get around this about recreating everything, excuse me. But I have some issues with it. So for now, we're going to do this. We will come back to Millionaire mod. Should I be able to do it? If worse comes to the worst, I'll have to start the playthrough all over again. I've saved the map as a backup, but I'd rather not have to reinstall everything if I can help it. Now, displaying what's saying off my mouse map once more. Uh, I've got a couple of mods installed. This is the same setup as I have with um, my, 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 my hardcore playthrough. Uh, let's see, let me show you what I've got equipped. I've got one extra mod equipped on this that isn't on the hardcore playthrough, but it's probably not going to be used that much on this gameplay. You'll see in a minute why. So I've also got Optifine, mod, uh, Forge Mod Loader, and I've got REI Minimap. Too many items, which we won't be using. Custom NPCs, which also we won't be using. And we've got Enchanting Plus. It basically allows me to pick my enchantments, uh, but it costs a lot more XP to do so. Uh, inventory Tweaks. If you guys don't know about that, it basically... Uh, if I'm using something and it breaks or I run out of the stack of it, it will auto replace it if I have it in my inventory. It also allows me to sort my items so that, say it's all jumbled up, all the items of the same type will be next to each other. I can do it with chests, chests as well. Staircraft, it basically allows me to build stairs out of almost anything. And wall jump, which is the one we won't be using but it adds a little bit of free running into it sort of thing can bounce off walls like in Mario sort of thing so let's say it is a map download there will be a link in the description for the map so let's jump in any second now there we are alright so first things first we are going to want to grab everything that's in here get this out of the way now this last time I played this map was on version 1.4.5 1.4.7 something like that I have added in some stuff now previously this one's got the mob on it there previously uh, animals were spawn eggs it seems now as you can see the fences you can see also see on the mini map the green dots so it seems now that the animals are alive they're here but they're trapped in those areas, so let's grab this chest, we need to move it. Whoa, some frame rate there, frame rate issues. Alright, before we do anything with the area, we need to get some grass. So, we're going to need some seeds. And hope that it's kind to us. Okay, got far too many flowers here. Come on, give me what I need. Yes. Last time I played this, it spawned you out on a, a three by three square of dirt. So you can obviously see that they've changed that. It was like a three by three by three. It was like three wide, three long, and three deep. I've popped them in there. Now, how am I going to do this? It's, there are 10 uh, chests to pick up. There is also a large list, oh dear, of items, uh, of challenges. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to stop the recording in just one second so that it allows me to 
you know, take a screenshot or something of the list, pop it into the uh, video real quick. And if you guys want to have a look at the challenges, feel free to pause it. It might well be a double page or double screenshot thing going on, but all right, so I'm gonna pause it right now and I'll see you in two seconds, if that. All right, guys, I'm back. I don't know if you have my daughter there, she's a little confused about what I was doing. <laughs> she's uh, currently washing like, on the sofa, just relaxing. She's not been well. Bless her, she's got tonsillitis. If any of you feel, uh, want, wish to tell her, you know, get well soon or anything, please feel free to do so in the comments. Her name is Katie. Spelt with an IE. I'm sure she'll be thrilled to see all the get well soons from all my viewers. Because I've got shift held down permanently right now. Now I am of course. Oh, that was close. Setting this up so that we can make the cobblestone generator. In fact, let's. Oh dear. Let's pop that back in there so we don't lose it. Am I, have I got my difficulty on hard? Yes, I do. This is a little nerve-wracking, I must say. Yes. Yeah, let's hope it, for the best. Yes, got it. One, two, three. Yeah, we might need another layer added anyway. Oh. But, here we are. Now, there is a chest directly underneath this thing. It's a little difficult to get to, and we're not going to attempt it until we have the... Oh, damn. Hold on. We need that like that for a minute. Reason being, we need the grass to spread down onto here. Completely forgot about that. Um, hmm. I don't know how we're going to get that. No, it's not going to work. Looks like we're going to lose one of them. Oh no, we've got it. Nice. Right, well, what we'll do is we'll spread out this way. A little bit. There, that's all we're going to use. Because we're going to need that later on. We're going to plant the tree for now because we're going to need wood. No point having a cobblestone generator if, you know, we can't do anything with it. Just move this. Grab the chest. There we are. Let's pop this far corner here for now. Right, well, we have nothing to do right this second but to wait. So, what I'm probably going to do, guys, is I'm just going to pause the recording here until we have a tree grown, or maybe even further. I'll wait till one tree is grown. I won't cut it down, and I will maybe wait until this is spread downwards in fact let's add this here and you know let's just oh didn't mean to do that oh you can see the feathers on the top left hand side of my screen that's part of the wall jump mod If I do this, it might help. I think I've done this before on a different server. When I, on a server, like a PvP based server, when I was building my house sort of high up in the air, I did that completely wrong. Um, and we wanted gra needed grass up there. I like, did it like 400 blocks. No, not 400 blocks up. You can't build 400 blocks up. But about 100 blocks up in the air. There we go. Well, I just need to wait for that. Pop this in there in case I die. Now, as I say, in that chest that's underneath that bedrock, it's like literally you can't open it, so you've got to build underneath it, destroy it, grab what you can, sort of thing. Um, there is only, what is it, four, eight, 16 string, enough to make a bed. This is going to have to be moved now. Um, let's hope we don't lose anything. With it. 
Alright then guys, well I'm going to pause it here and let things just happen and I shall see you when I when it's done. Alright, I won't do anything else, you know what's in the inventory, you know what, well, you know I've got nothing and yeah so I'll see you soon. Alright guys, I'm back, I've waited and it's taken quite a while actually but things have grown a little bit as you can see. And the tree, oh my god, it's like we couldn't have asked for a better starter tree. I mean, look at this thing. Right, so we're going to remove these ones now that are no longer necessary. That's it, come on. If you want, uh, I just want to show you, say nothing new on the messages about, oh, excuse me. I do apologise about anything being spawned in or anything like that. So, I literally just stood there and waited. Well, I say stood there and waited. I went and watched something while it happened. But I did have it. Oh, one thing that I did change. So, I did have it in peaceful. Because we have no torches on here. Just in case mobs spawned in while we were dealing with it. So, I think that was fair enough. Well, let's leave that one. Let's hope we don't lose any of this. have to be really 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 careful it is very nerve-wracking there we are let's pop this right there now we need one more so we can get an axe going and then the rest of the wood shall be put towards that stuff to be able to mine cobble with and build so we can build out so over there Grab iron, get some gold, some redstone. We'll leave the diamonds. What we'll do is we have to build down and around the tower to build a platform out or place water all the way down. But which one of these has obsidian? There it is. <laughs> That's a lot of obsidian. Um, we're going to need to build a platform all the way around the base of that in order to catch everything. We'll leave the diamonds until we've managed to get a fortune on our pickaxe fact possibly need it on the redstone as well ah oh, we need to get some diamonds obviously just realized it's gonna need it for there we are oh cool we've got a sapling gonna need it for the what's it called 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 enchanting table yes I think that's all of it Oh no, the apple! The apple! No! Well, well, apple, we knew you well. Oh, it is a shame. Anything else to drop down? We've got a sapling. Pop the saplings in here. Oh. Bye. We'll allow that to continue to degrade on its own now. Right. Gonna need. We'll just keep one and we'll make the rest into wood. We're gonna need three of these soon. In fact, let's pop it all up here out of the way. Look at you, because we need to pick up the crafting table again. It's in the way now. All right, we need to make the cobblestone generator. So, one, two, three, four, five. Damn it. We need to come out one more on both sides like this. I mean, don't get me wrong, we're going to be building out from this level anyway. But, I really don't want to use any more than is necessary, to be honest with you. So, one, two, three, four, five, yeah. Yeah, this is going to be problematic. Oh, don't need that one there. Alright, here's what we're going to do. We're going to have to use some wood. 
as well. So we'll grab all these ones. Like so. There we are. Well, this is going to be the water end. Um, yeah, it needs to go one higher. Oh no. No, 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 no. That's alright, that's alright, that's alright. We can take these ones. Very dangerous work, but we can do it. Whoa! Almost ended everything right there. Word of warning to anyone playing this map. You need to get a bed down before you die. And sleeping it, because... Otherwise... The spawn is actually broken. So, fair warning. Right. Um, so yeah, because that needs to be like that. And pop you there. Right. So we need one, two, three, four, five, and six. There, we're done. Right. No! We're going to have to use that. We're going to have to. We've got no choice. Damn it. But, what we can do, be sneaky about this. We've got three blocks of dirt left. So, if we take you, you, and you. So that way we don't have to use it now. We can place them here, here, and here. What we're going to do, plant the tree here. We don't have enough to make a hoe just yet. What we'll do, very carefully, there we are, <laughs> make one out of stone once we've got some. That way, we're going to need these before it gets too dark. Now, oh snap, I did forget about something. Guess we are going to need that after all. Um, hmm. Problem is, it's going to burn away. I guess we can't do this just yet then. No sneakiness for us. Damn it. Oh, we can be one sneaky. We can be one sneaky, so we do get the sap thing. Where are we at? There and there. Right, so we'll place you there. And you there. Now we need to get out break this. Well, I barely touched it. There we are. Now this will change. I'm, I can't remember which direction it will go in, but what? Thank you. There it is. So what we're going to do, as we get gathering more cobble, we will slowly replace the dirt. There we are. Let's be really careful with this at times. And this is going to be fairly boring. I, I am fully aware, guys. It's just a necessary mo uh, thing to do at the beginning. So, come on. At least we've got some nice music to do it with. Get my coffee. Well, I suppose I could always read you off the list of stuff we need to do. Um, while I'm doing this. That way I won't actually need to do the whole screenshot thing. I apologise to anyone who did uh, pause it for the screenshot. But let's see. Scroll to the top. I'm doing it off my laptop, so I'm kind of operating two PCs at once here. Let's get a bit closer. Right, cobblestone generator. Done. Uh make an infinite water source. Well, we need a second source block for that. 
uh, make your house 20 blocks from the island. <coughs> Expand the island. Well, we've already done that. Uh, even though we've only done what, what a few couple of rows, but it's already been expanded out. Uh, trade with all the villagers. That actually may be them, thinking about it. Those green dots. Don't let villagers die or fall. Now, that's going to be difficult. That really is going to be a difficult one to do. Um, we're going to have to build them some houses for them to live in. And then surround the area with gates. Like have a, a pressure pla pad to get them in, but not get out. Uh, let's see. Build a little house for the villagers. Oh, well, there's that. In fact, what we can do is we can actually breed a, uh, make a spawning pit and count that as their house. Uh, uh, basically, it's a place that they'll breed and create more villages. Collect all the resources from the chests. Ten of them. Craft a bed. Make a melon farm, pumpkin farm, carrot farm, sugarcane farm, potato farm, neverwort farm, wheat farm. Make giant mushrooms. Now, the only way we can make giant mushrooms is if they have included... <coughs> The Mushroom Island Purple Grass. Uh, make 10 cows, 10 pigs, 10 chickens, sheep, ocelots, all 10 of them. We need 10 of them. Get one cat. Get a dog slash wolf. Make a wall of achievements with item frames. Craft a beacon. Now that's going to be difficult to get hold of unless we've got all the bits sitting in the chest already. Uh... Craft an anvil, 10 flower pots, 64 stone bricks, 64 torches, 64 bricks. Craft a furnace, make an ender chest, nether portal, go to the end, kill the dragon, collect a dragon egg, uh, defeat the wither. Yeah, so we're going to have to get the, the star thing from defeating the wither boss. So that is going to be difficult. Make a small lake, build a mob trap, craft a cookie, make a pumpkin pie, five snow golems, two iron golems. Oh, we're gonna need some more, another pick. Got a nice little amount of cobble going on there. Let's uh, turn that into as well. Where, where, where were we? Um, whoa, 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 whoa. My mouse just did that all on its own. It just like went crazy, got stuck on the on position for a moment. Alright, where's my pick? So the last one we said was uh, mob trap, make cookie, pumpkin pie, snow golem, five snow golems, two iron golems. Make 10 mushroom stew, 10 jack-o'-lanterns, 10 bookcase, make a cake, 20 rails and use them for something. Uh, an enchantment table, enchant all your tools, enchant your armour, craft a brewing stand, craft all the potions. Now, are we going to count that as um, one speed, one invisibility and so on and so forth, or... Are we going to have to include that as each of them, like speed plus all its strength plus one, but one a speed one for all its strength and all its time values, or or what? You know, you guys know what I'm on about. And does that include having to make extras for splash potions as well? Let me know in the comments what you think on that. Uh, five powered rails, tw collect twenty ender pearls. Uh, 10 fish, scrolling down, where, where is it, where's it gone, fish, there we go, craft 10 black wool, grey wool, light grey, lime green, red wool, yellow, pink, green, orange, 10 of each basically, uh, craft 20 potion, uh, paintings, craft a piston, craft a sticky piston, 16 glass panes, 128 arrows. I don't know where they got come up with that arbitrary number. I know that's two stacks, but 
20 slabs of each kind. Thank God I haven't got the uh, slab mod in. Uh, 10 signs, 20 ladders, 30 fences, 5 fence gate, 5 trap doors, craft a bow, make a redstone contraption, which I have a very good idea what I want to do for that. Um, 64 bone meal, 10 stairs of each kind. Now, I'm only going to include the ones that are part of vanilla Minecraft, not the ones that are part of my mod. Post a screenshot of your wall of achievements. Craft 64 TNT and get rid of everything. That's all the achievements. I've got a nice little amount of cobblestone from that. So, I think it's safe for us, first off, to pick that up. Where's the chest gone? Let us make a stone axe. I'm going to get rid of the word. Going to mouse, don't fail me now, please. I'm going to replace it all with cobble. And we can expand out and whoa, 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 panic mode, panic mode. Oh, whoopsie. Right, um, it's just there. And there. Now I need to take these two out. We'll get to that other one in just a moment. I just hope we don't destroy the water source by accident. Whoa, there we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is not, this is not a good place or time to be getting frame rate like that. Whoa, what's going on? It's like, as high up as we are, we're also fighting the flow of water. Whoa. I wasn't afraid that was the water. Mm hmm. Right. Plop you there. There we go. Have that one. No. Bye, word. Can't get them all. Unfortunately. Right. Now. Yes, we have safety down here. If I can drop down there. Nervous. Yeah, there we go. I was really right. Oh my god. There we are. Let's get rid of that one. We don't need that now. I can go. I need to get down here, which is slightly easier. I hope we haven't destroyed all the grass. If I have, then I will probably just. I don't know spawn in just that one glass block. I know I said we wouldn't be spawning anything in, but given what the, given the nature of what it is, it's not as if we can just... Oh, well maybe we can make it spread down, but we'd have to use dirt to get to the, to get the dirt to move. So that would be incredibly difficult to do. I would probably just spawn in one dirt. <gasps> oh my God. It just give me heart attack, you know. <sighs> I'm sorry about that, guys. Oi. It's just like very, very scary when something like that goes wrong. Oh dear. There we are. Thank God for that. Um, yeah, so we'll see what happens. I think though so. we don't actually have any viable dirt blocks. We just lost one of the dirt. Alright, so that's there, that's there. Um, yeah, it needs to go out one more, doesn't it? Right, so. That needs to be there. How are we doing in the episode? Well, that's half an hour, guys that away and next episode we're gonna bring this out in fact I'm gonna do this on the episode guys it's gonna go like that oh there we are and 
to be fair about it all, I'm just going to let that one fly off and just replace it like so. Alright, well, thank you very much for watching guys. Keep an eye on my channel, I'm going to be posting a video soon, um, inquiring about the length of my videos and how I should proceed with things. So, keep an eye out for that and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.